Shalom, and welcome to the Parak of the Week. This week we are beginning Chapter 3 of Pirkei Avot. Akavya teaches us, Akavya the son of Mahalel, reflect on three things and you will not come into the hands of sin. Know from where you come and where you are going and before whom you will have to give a judgment and accounting in the future. From whence did you come? From a putrid drop. And where are you going? To a place of dust, worms, and maggots. And before whom you will have to give judgment and accounting in the future to the ruler of all rulers, the Holy One, blessed is God. It's kind of a graphic summary of what our lives are all about. The major takeaway is to set, have a sense of humility, to have a humble perspective on our own sense of our greatness. Akavya lived through the destruction of the Second Temple in the year 70 CE, so he was well aware of the reality of suffering and also of the depth of human capability to do wrong. He reminds us that we all face the same beginning of life, the same ending, and that we will all be held accountable for how we chose to spend that time in between our birth and our death. Where did we come from? Here he reminds us of our common humanity. We share the same beginning as every human being. No one is greater than another we are all created in the image of God. Where we are going, when we reflect on the inevitability of our own death, we may let go of our attachment to the things of this world. It is for good reason that traditional shrouds have no pockets to remind us that we can't take it with us. And to whom will we have to give an accounting Akavya invites us to think about whether we will feel proud of how we spent the gift of time with which we were blessed. He encourages us to think about that now while we still have time to adjust our behavior so that it is in line with our priorities. Something to think about this week. Shavuotov.